hello YouTube and welcome to another video about our checkpoint firewall so today we're gonna see how actually you can monitor your uh, firewall so in order to configure that we'll be using a network uh, monitoring software called Cacti so this software actually uses uh, the SNMP protocol in order to monitor our uh, firewall so the first thing we have to look on as always to our uh, to our firewall in order to configure SNMP so we go to uh, setup see a tab called management as you can see in the bottom we notice the SNMP which stands for simple network management protocol so we have to set up SNMP for our router so it's very easy actually all you have to do is to name a community we go to advanced so the most important thing is to rename or make your own community you can call it whatever you want you can call here I call it that data PPC but you can call whatever you want and another important thing is also the trap destination actually the trap destination is the server who will be monitoring our firewall and here which version of SNMP will be using you can choose version 1 or version 2 so the version 2 actually is really common so we're gonna change it we're gonna choose it then for the trap destination I'll be using a server here that has IP address of 192.168.1.15 and the uh, default port stands 162 so the most important thing here is our community and our IP address of our uh, server and actually in that server will be installing Cacti so Cacti is a monitoring tool that will allow us to monitor our firewall and will be especially monitoring the bandwidth so in order to use it we have to download it it's open source and it's free so you go to download section uh, yes to download cacti and download directory and if you are using windows you go to the bottom you will find a folder named packages click on it Windows and here you can choose the package you want to use actually I downloaded this one cacti.0.8.8c it's quite a big uh, install but it deserves to be installed like that I already installed it I'm not going to show you how you can configure Rectai because I will be explaining that in another video because, because it's so long to explain how you can install it, how you can configure it but here I will just show you the most important things so the install is very easy actually all you have to do is to click on it and then next 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 and voila
So, after you install Cacti, you log on to your computer with, and you open your browser and you tap this address, which is our localhost slash Cacti. And you will get an interface with uh, you will get an interface with your username and password so when you log on normally when you install cacti you will be given a random password but after the install you can change it of course as I told you I will explain how you can install Cacti in another video so the first thing in order to monitor our firewall you have to go to a section called device and here you click on the link called add then you give a name to your firewall you can example call it checkpoint and the most important thing here is you have to provide IP address of your firewall by default is 192.168.1.1 and here is the most important section as you can see here you can configure your SNMP parameters as we did in uh, in our firewall if you remember we used community.ppc and this is the IP address of the server where I have installed our cacti and SNMP is version 2 so all you have to do actually is to choose which version we have used so we choose version 2 then the community we have to change it data ppc and that's all we have already in our that's all we have to do i already configured that so i will show you so this is my devices that I have created as you can see I configured the version and the community that's all you have to do then in the above you have to click on the link called create graph for this host you click on it and you will you, you will notice just at the bottom all the interfaces that your firewall has so you can choose any interface you want to monitor you click just on it and after that you have to click on the button create and it will create it will create actually a graph for this interface it will show you the bandwidth of this interface so you go to your graph management and you choose I already added a lot of graphs but you have to choose the one that you have just added for example like that and you add it to uh, to your tree I'll explain that in another video because it needs a lot of time, a lot of configuration. And you click the, on the go. After that, if you go to your graphic section, you will notice that you will notice all the graph that we have added to our cacti application actually it's web application and as you can see here you can see 
the graphics that monitor every interface you have chosen and above you can choose actually which day you can choose actually which day which time you have to monitor so that's all you can also monitor the load average and CPU usage of your firewall so the most difficult part is to configure actually cacti which I will be doing in another video so in this video I just give you an overview how you can actually use cacti in order to monitor the firewall hope it was informative for you and thank you for your viewing thank you